Pineapple is a great fruit to have in your smoothies. I love it, but I like it frozen. So I'm going to show you how I freeze pineapple cubes. So I always start out rinsing the pineapple first in some water just to get all kinds of whatever's on the outside off. And then I slice off both ends with a large knife. Now some people who are more purists would put the, the cut pineapple vertically and then cut down with a big knife, but yeah, I would cut myself. I know me, that's what I would do. So I set it on its side and I cut it into discs. And then once I cut a couple discs, I'm just gonna use the big knife and slice all around the edge. This is the safest, fastest way that I can get it done. Yeah, fast and safe at the same time. And then after I cut off the edges, I decide if I want to include the core. Now, since I'm making smoothies, I can include the core if I want and just cut all that up and freeze it. But you can throw the core out if you want. So I cut it into cubes. And after it's cut into cubes, I set it on a baking sheet. And I, in advance, I make sure that the baking sheet I choose is going to fit into my freezer. I have a side by side, so the freezers tend to be really narrow. So I put all of the pineapple cubes on the, on the tray and I make sure as much as possible that they're not touching each other because I don't want them to freeze together. Then I put it in the freezer and I let it freeze for at least four hours or overnight. After they're frozen, I scoop them up and put them into freezer bags. Just make sure you buy freezer bags and not regular Ziploc type plastic bags. They have to say freezer bags on the outside, they're thicker, and I use the quart size. Then I pop the quart size bags right back into the freezer and they're ready for me to use whenever I make a smoothie. I want you to check some of my other videos out on how I freeze other types of fruit. You can click the description, that's why I pointed I click the description box below to open it up and I'll have links to videos there. Please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. You can also click the little eye in the upper right hand corner for other related fruit freezing videos or click one of the images on the right side of your screen and I have a related video on making a strawberry pineapple colada smoothie, which is so good. Thanks for watching, bye.